Good morning, it's Sunday the 30th of July 2023 and welcome to Kinloch Huon. So we're in the process of walking into Barrasdale Bay. Just started, just left the car park. And the plan is to do the three main roads to the west of Noidart. So hopefully the weather will allow us to do that. In Loch Huron, this is it's about 11 kilometre walk into Barrisdale Bay. A good path all the way, but a few bumps to go up and over. This is up the, the first bump, another couple to go. The forecast has the day improving as the afternoon goes on, so we're hopeful. That's certainly a remote spot. Access by boat. That's looking across the Larvin. It's looking really well. We're coming round to Barris there will be. This is in at the, the Bothy. Two and three quarter hours, 11 kilometres. And the WC. That's us had a nice lunch. Uh, it's about two o'clock, so we're just going to head out and do the pair. So Mill Bay and Lenny Bin will be the first one. Uh, and there's a good track takes you up to the the low point there. You can see the V are just on the right hand side. Park's a lot lighter now. Yeah, we're leaving the stuff in the buffy. That's Ben Screel in the centre there with a the cloud on it. That's us up to Arm Barrisdale, looking over the other side. So when you're going down for the ferry, that comes in from my leg. This is the claggy thing that we've got in front of us. It's looking west to Larven. And you'll see on the right here in the background that's been screel. It's me be now clear. Monroe's on the, the right hand side as we look at it. We'll come off the centre shoulder there and down to the river and then cut up again. That's our first Monroe when you mint. Not a bad vantage point. Okay. Right, well done. That was looking well just now, the sun on it in the background. We 
you know, buoy just picked up a wee bit cloud again and that's our connecting ridge so we'll drop down to that and make our way over Right, we're just going to cut down now Actually, a little queue in the background there Gary away at the back, screw more just to the right of the lock and screw the keys, a picky one just right of centre and we're just turning round because we're going up that that's the shoulder we're going up just looking back at the first mineral you come out to this east end to pick up the path a wee bit around the houses for getting onto this second mineral the first mineral to the right here just picking up a wee bit cloud and this is the final down A bit of wispy cloud there, nice moved in. Hopefully, that will just keep going. This is the stop. Well, my nose just out of you, but yet. That's the top there. That's the second mineral. Here we wait. Hold on. I'm gonna head down here and the show up. Just be our left a wee bit. You see the coal just across at the in the centre of the frame. Just the right of centre, that's what we're making for. That's the black cooling in the, the distance. Almost clear, a wee bit of cloud on it. Right, we're just heading down for this. This burn down here. I'll cross it then up to the low point on the other side. That's just the connecting ridge between the two minerals. Okay. Take some fluids here. Mumbar's deal. It's all downhill now. Right in the middle background you've got a screw and a sign to the right of centre and the saddle to the left of centre in Glen Shield. And they're looking really well with the low sun. That's us back. It's a really super day. Uh, six hours, 15 minutes. And it was 17 kilometres and 1881 meters ascent so quite a big day considering that we walked in this morning as well 
So if you've made it this far, many thanks. And we'll catch you on the next one. Just a wee footnote, this is what we woke up to in the next day. A mixed forecast. Uh, rain all day, potential lightning. There's a hill in there somewhere. But not today. We'll be back. <laughs>